Lee Coulter, I'm a singer, songwriter, producer, I share music, that's what I'm passionate about, and uh, originally from Australia, Brisbane, Australia. If I were the sea, I would love to see you smile at me, walk the shore a mile with me. So when I was, uh, you know, 10 years old, I mean, my mother always had a guitar around the house. She used to be in a band in the 60s with her sisters, just jamming in the garage. And so there was always a guitar around my house. And my brother picked up guitar after we both heard this Simon and Garfunkel uh, record that my dad brought home. And he started playing guitar and singing, and I started doing harmonizing with him. And then a couple years later, I was like, I need to play the guitar. So I started playing bass, about 12 years old, and then all through high school, I was in like grunge bands. Just uh, the way it made me feel from a kid to, to today, it just makes me feel like the, there's a connection there and um, something to share with, with strangers, with, with people you know, with loved ones. It, it's the, I feel like it's a uniting force, so I like being a part of it. If I were a song, I would love to be a symphony. Through music, I was very driven from a very early age. I, I knew that's what I wanted to do from about 15 years old. It's like I knew that was what I wanted to do, and that's kind of the age where I would have expected to really start getting introduced to, to drugs and the party scenes. And So, you know, when, I don't know if I was uh, so driven into music that I was so focused around that age 15 when I started getting into it that I wasn't aware of what was going on around me, or maybe I was just playing docile that... Uh, you know, it was happening. And I saw pot and I saw definitely alcohol at parties, especially in Australia, but uh, I just I just veered away from it, firstly because I, I heard that, you know, you could ruin your life um, and you see examples of it. And I have this ability that to, to learn from other people's mistakes and yes, I make my own mistakes, but um, that was one that I could, I, I just knew I didn't want to go down that, down that path at an early age. I like to have fun. Uh, I, I like to, in Australia, it's really w rare to like want to dance. And I loved to dance when I was a teenage boy, which is like not, not cool in Australia. But I did that and I had fun, so I, I don't know, maybe I didn't need that another outlet. I wasn't searching for any outside source to give me this kind of high, you know. I'd be so proud of the love we send if I were you. I mean, when I started out this path of being a musician, and even early on in, in, in my teenage family life, when, when I was still at home with my parents or my mom, she was a single mom by the time I was a teenager, we were broke. and. The idea that people were forking out money to have stuff that was just like, you know, this extracurricular fun or, you know, fun. Um, so there's going down that path and getting to the point I am, it's not like, uh, you know, I don't want to feel like I'm, I'm judging anyone else, but for me, uh, it worked out and uh, I feel like, I know, I like the fact that I can have fun and I know it's all, it's all real, it's all in my head. It comes from creativity, it comes from loving friends instead of just being a... I mean, something that's uh, enhanced, you know, performance enhancing <laughs> drugs, you know, and, and life enhancing drugs. Like, to me, it's like, you, you should live your life in a way that you feel like it's enhanced to its part, to extreme without, uh, without, you know, any sort of help from, from substances. You know, I've got a loving wife who, who I know loves me and I feel good about that. And, uh, and I've got a son that, you know, um, he loves me too. And all this stuff that's real and, and con as connection and, and um, to me, that that's what's worked out, and I couldn't see it any other way, and I don't know any other way, so I can't I can't compare. But for me, it's good. My name's Lee Coulter, and my natural high is definitely sharing songs. If I were money, I would love to end poverty. Instead, they keep.